Hello once again, and welcome to MNC, your Mavro News Channel. Hi there, I'm your host Mark. Join me as we once again explore the vast world of MMM BSC. As mentioned in the last edition, we will have a deeper examination of MMM blockchain smart contract and what sets it apart from others in this episode. We'll explore next the cryptocurrency that powers MMM BSC. Also, Guider Milson One will be with us for his just my opinion. So, without further ado, come on, let's begin. Last time, we already had a glimpse into MMM's technical history and the timeline on how MMM Blockchain Smart Contract or MMM BSC came into life. We were also able to talk about the four advantages of MMM BSC system. MMM BSC Blockchain Smart Contract Mutual Aid System 6.0 came into being with huge costs. With over 12 months efforts, the elite team of blockchain experts have repeatedly tested things to perfect the combination of mutual aid model logic and technology logic. The main goal is to solve the contradiction of financial centralization and come up with a decentralized solution that takes the privacy and safety of members into consideration. Awesome feat, right? But I know like me, you also have unanswered questions. We asked MMM, BSC, and some of its core guiders and got our answers. Every member of the launch team is anonymous. You don't need to trust any person. You only need to read the system mechanism and rules and trust its decentralized blockchain smart contract. Here, the code is law, similar to when Satoshi Nakamoto launched Bitcoin. The technology of the decentralized blockchain smart contract system of MMM BSC are fully integrated with Mabrodi's thoughts and ideas and the MMM mutual fund model, its original mixing model of shared banking, plus donation model, plus jackpot model, plus decentralized system, plus blockchain smart contract, plus dollar anchored cryptocurrency effectively solves a series of problems such as this you are seeing on your screen. At the same time, the long-term holding of the dollar anchoring cryptocurrency is equal to the holding of dollars. It crosses the barriers of foreign exchange control imposed by countries and allows their will to synchronize with the dollars. On March 26, 2018, Russian official news and global mainstream media made relevant reports about the founder of MMM, Sergei Mavrodi, sudden passing away due to myocardial infarction. Then on April 6, 2018, MMM website announced its global suspension to avoid the blasphemy of Sergei Mavrodi's ideas. This was the best choice as it completely preserved Sergei Mavrodi's ideology and mission. But as a great thought liberation movement, and financial revolution, MMM's idea, mission, and fate will survive forever. After Sergey Mavrodi died, a variety of models of MMM mutual fund system appeared in the world. Imitators rose in different countries that have nothing to do with the MMM mutual fund created by Sergey Mavrodi. Sadly, those who should have held up the flag of MMM mutual aid not only discarded Sergey Mavrodi's ideology and missions, but also use MMM mutual aid model as a tool for money accumulation. They use centralized, non-transparent system that lacks supervision and audit, hence system administrators were able to commit deceit and fraud. They have solid the vision of Sergey Mavrodi. It has led people to misunderstand the real essence of the MMM's mutual aid model, the financial and mental emancipation of ordinary people so MMM mutual aid community members today must be vigilant and should learn how to identify these deceivers. Whoever can profoundly interpret and integrate Sergei Mavrodi's visions and missions 
his beliefs and passions, walk his life and continue to fulfill his unfinished aspirations, will be his true successor and banner bearers of the MMM Mutual Fund model. Sergey Mavrodi made it clear that he would only point out a golden boulevard of financial revolution for people. He pointed out that financial enlightenment was inevitable and that together we should break the old world order by destroying unequal financial practices and slavery so we can create a decentralized, fairer, and more transparent system that can make people happy. Despite keeping with the idea of Mavrodi, MMM BSC made sure to innovate and avoid the mistake of the old model. MMM BSC's blockchain smart contract is decentralized and does not need human control so the wrongs in the old MMM model can be avoided. Simply speaking, smart contract is the digital and network version of traditional contracts. Smart contracts are computer programs that run on blockchain and execute themselves when meeting the condition of being written into source code. Once a smart contract is written, it can be trusted by users. The terms of the contract is unchangeable and no one can change it so code is law. Nowadays, although smart contract has not been widely used in practice, its advantages has been widely recognized by researchers and industry insiders. In general, smart contract has the following advantages. Number one, high efficient real-time update. Number two, accurate execution. Number three, lower human intervention risk. Number four, decentralized authority. Number five, lower operation costs. The centralized system of traditional PHP programming is vulnerable to attacks from hackers. Once it is hacked, they can tamper with system data and change the execution rules. However, the data operation of the centralized smart contract system is on the ERC20 blockchain instead of computing the storing data on the local server. The website front end seen by participants only reads the data that displays blockchain operation. But the whole back end data is built on the blockchain and it is not owned by anyone. If the website front end has been hacked, please do not worry, it can be recovered. In summary, here is what MMM BSC smart contract system offers to its members. Anonymity. The registration system only requires adding an email address and a digital wallet and there is no need to provide personal information so no one would know who you are. Stability. The cryptocurrency in MMM BSC is anchored to US dollar and one is to one ratio is adopted for transfer. Participants will have no risk of ups and downs of currency's price as characterized in Bitcoin. Trustworthy. Once a participant triggers certain clause in the contract, the code will run automatically, completely free from human control. Open. Blockchain smart contract data are traceable and completely open. No one can cheat on money. Fair. The team structure is registered on the blockchain. No one can move your team. No bureaucracy. No one can close it. Fast. Available for trading at global exchange. 24-7 real-time trading. Global payment can be received immediately. Efficient. Blockchain smart contract can run automatically 24-7. It can operate independently and realize transaction timely. Safe. With blockchain smart contract system, you don't have to worry about attacks of network hackers. It is a great technological revolution. Whoa, that was a lot to sink in, right? But as you can see, the people behind MMM blockchain smart contract has meticulously thought of things. They were able to combine the ideas of the old MMM minus the flaws that it had with an innovative decentralized system backed by a more stable cryptocurrency. I talk a lot already, so I am going to have Gaider Emil San Juan take over for now. What do we have in store for today, in your just my opinion? Gaider Emil? Great day to all our participants and future participants of MM community. This is Emil, and you are watching another segment of Just My Opinion. During the last episode, we had a short review 
of MMMBSC or Blockchain Smart Contract, wherein we discuss the improvements of the new system and how it can help the participants. For today's episode, we are not going to cover any technical aspect inside the community, but instead, we are going to discuss about the number one most important rule that you should follow when joining MMM. The reason I want to give emphasis to this rule is because as I observe in the whole community, this rule is often neglected, overlooked, or taken for granted by nearly all of the participants. You heard it right. There are only a handful of people in MMM who gives priority to this rule. And you know what the end result is? It's chaos. Now, you might be asking, what is this rule I'm talking about? Well, to get it straight, the answer is always in your dashboard or in MMM website. You're always seeing it, but it's always ignored. The rule that says, participate only with your spare money. A very simple rule that even a first grader kid can follow, yet most of us keeps on neglecting. This basic rule, when applied seriously, can bring MMM to a whole new level. How do I say so? Well, if you try to observe the past histories of MMM, one of the main contributors to the panic, post mode and restart, is the overflowing greed of people trying to make a huge fortune out of MMM. They are the people who are risking their money in MMM, yet they are not ready to lose it because it's not their spare assets. They are the people who loves to risk but hates to lose because they only expect to win from the system. So when the time comes that their expectation failed, sad to say, they also face a huge breakdown. There's nothing wrong about wanting to gain more. I mean, it's human nature. What's wrong is putting all these assets you have into something you don't have full control of. We have to admit it. MMM is a huge community of people and since we have different mindsets, uncertainties are always present. That's why even when Mabrodi is still alive, there's always a dedicated page for risk and warning. The purpose is to become honest and transparent so as to avoid false hopes from participants. But when MMM community grew rapidly, this very simple rule to participate with spare money had been taken for granted by the majority. Many people lost a huge portion of their assets because they participated with the amount they are not willing to lose, an amount that's no longer a spare money for them. And I can't blame these people. Honestly, I might do the same thing if I found an opportunity that can change my life. That's why it is very important to make decisions based from an informed perspective and not just based on emotion. So, if you're watching this video right now, whether you're a total newbie to MMM or a participant from previous systems, you should always take this rule seriously to keep you away from headaches if something happens unexpectedly. Again, participate only with spare money and always take responsibility for your actions. That's it for today. I'll see you again on the next episode. This email saying, remember that everything that I said in this video is just my opinion. Have a great day, guys, and bye-bye. In the previous episode, the prices I mentioned were in a currency that is foreign to me, unlike US dollars, Bitcoin, or Ethereum. So what is USD PAX? A PAXOS USD token is not itself a US dollar. But Paxos Trust Company LLC is responsible for backing every token with the US dollar held in segregated accounts at FDIC insured. US Bank's Paxos Trust Company LLC is also responsible for issuing and redeeming each token in exchange for $1 USD PAX. Represented in the wallet as PAX, it's known as Stablecoin and is fully supported in the blockchain wallet. In general, a stablecoin is a cryptocurrency asset designed to minimize the price volatility typically associated with cryptocurrencies. To that end, a stablecoin will typically be pegged to another asset or group of assets such as another currency or commodity. Holding USD packs in your blockchain wallet means that you can easily transition between volatile cryptocurrencies and a token pegged to USD, while the fiat estimation of your other cryptocurrency balances will change with the market. The value of your USD PAX balance will always remain the same and change only with transactions that add to or subtract from your PAX balance. You just must remember that PAX is an ERC-20 token, 
which means that any transactions with it will cost an additional but small fee in ETH. The use of cryptocurrency packs has solved the regime barrier of free exchange and the free trade of national legal currency. The Paxos standard combines the advantages of blockchain technology with the regulation of financial regulators plus dollar endorsement and valued assets for trade. And thus, it is reliable and secure. As a cryptocurrency in line with the ERC20 smart contract standard, Paxo Trust Company can make up for the instability in the digital currency market by delivering on the underlying technology network of the Ethernet ERC20. MMM BSC system is one of the first batch of ERC20 smart contract blockchain technologies in the world. The main advantages of PAX are Supervision and auditing PAX is the first company in the world to be regulated and audited by U.S. financial regulators. Smart contract PAX is built on the ETH ERC20 underlying network to achieve intelligence. Number three, no risk of ups and downs. PAX stable currency participates in the mutual aid system and there is no risk of loss of price fluctuation. Number four, the comprehensive assessment of PAX is the best. Stability, authority, high credit trading volume. The key is that it can implement the execution of smart contract logic. With these reasons, MMM BSC opted to use PAX in the donation exchange program of the community. That's all for this edition. Thank you for watching. I am Mark and this is MNC, your Mavro News Channel with MMM BSC. Always remember, together we change the world.